from the PS Arts team and today I am going to be leading you in a to-go project based on Francis Stark's artwork. Francis Stark was born in 1967 here in California. She is a multidisciplinary artist and she creates performances, she does drawing, she makes videos, and she also writes. Today we are going to focus on her drawings as an inspiration for our project. Her drawings typically include collages where she cuts out different forms such as flowers or plants from magazines or newspaper. She usually has a simple background with a pop of color. So it's gonna be really fun and to get started you are going to just need a few materials. So you are going to want to have white paper or cardstock. You will also want to have newspaper or some old magazines. Be sure that if you're going to use magazines from home to ask your parents what you can use. You will also need a pair of scissors and a glue stick as well as a black marker or pen and a red marker. So let's get started. Here is a sample of something your work might or could look like that I created before. Um, and now I'm going to create something new with you. So here we go.
fun. I love this project and I think it lends to so many different possibilities, um, just depending what you are feeling inspired by. Um, as you can see, I use both word or lettering cutouts. I also use different patterns. And I think um, for me, using both just added um, a different vibrancy and I really like um, the different textures it has. Um, you may also wanna consider creating a different shape such as an animal or a building or something around your house that really um, inspires you. Um, and remember, you can use shapes or patterns from a magazine or newspaper that feel good to you and really lend to your artwork. Um, I will say that there is one note that um, I cut out and you should cut out your flower petals or your um, different shapes before starting to glue them down. But once you get to the glue down portion of the project, if the shape doesn't work for you anymore, you can cut a new shape. So don't feel bad about that. You can just adapt as you go. Um, and I think the red marker really helps the um, image stand out. So overall, this was super fun. Um, I feel really inspired by Francis Stark, and I hope you will do this project too. Until next time, always remember that you have the freedom to imagine and the power to create. See you soon. Mm -hmm.